beyond the Earth and sending robot explorers to the planets and the stars. We humans long to be connected with our origins, so we create rituals. Science is another way to express this longing. It also connects us with our origins, and it too has its rituals and its commandments. Its only sacred truth is that there are no sacred truths. Temperature systems. All assumptions must be critically examined. Arguments from authority are worthless. AACS readout mode is telemetry. Transducer power is on. Whatever is inconsistent with the facts, no matter how fond of it we are, must be discarded or revised. Science is not perfect. It's often misused. It's only a tool, but it's the best tool we have. Self-correcting, ever-changing, applicable to everything. With this tool, we vanquish the impossible. Methods of science, we have begun to explore the cosmos. For the first time, scientific discoveries are widely accessible. Our machines, the products of our science, are now beyond the orbit of Saturn. A preliminary spacecraft reconnaissance has been made of 20 new worlds. We have learned to value careful observations, to respect the facts even when they are disquieting, when they seem to contradict conventional wisdom. The Canterbury monks faithfully recorded an impact on the moon, and the Anasazi people an explosion of a distant star. They saw for us as we see for them. We see further than they only because we stand on their shoulders. We build on what they knew. We depend on free inquiry and free access to knowledge. We humans have seen the atoms which constitute all of matter and the forces that sculpt this world and others. We have found that the molecules of life are easily formed under conditions common throughout the cosmos. We have mapped the molecular machines at the heart of life. We have discovered a microcosm in a drop of water. We have peered into the bloodstream and down on our stormy planet to see the Earth as a single organism. We have found volcanoes on other worlds and explosions on the sun, studied comets from the depths of space and traced their origins and destinies listened to pulsars and searched for other civilizations. We humans have set foot on another world, in a place called the Sea of Tranquility, an astonishing achievement for creatures such